Well, hey, buddy. It must be springtime. Nice of you to join me. So hey friends, I decided to go ahead and come out camping this weekend even though it is really warm today. It's like 84 degrees, feels like 91, that sort of thing. And they're calling for potential major thunderstorms, <laughs> hell, and you know, Texas spring. I thought, heck, what have I got to lose? <laughs> Let's do this thing. <laughs> no, I really don't think that those storms are going to hit here. You never know though, you really can never tell. So I'm just going to watch the clouds. And uh, yeah, be safe. My Van is not parked under any big trees, so I think I'll be okay. Other than the heat, it's supposed to be a beautiful weekend. It's not supposed to be as hot tomorrow, so looking forward to just a peaceful, chill weekend. Thought I'd take you along. I really don't expect it to be very crowded, but mostly because of the hype on the weather. They were calling earlier for hell, possibly the size of canned hams, and then they downgraded it to a uh, golf ball size, so <laughs> that might keep some people home. I hope so. I really think that the weatherman's just really been waiting a long time to be able to say <laughs> hellstones the size of canned hams. But uh, yeah, I don't think that's really going to happen. I guess we'll find out. I really think they like to hype the stuff. There are some clouds building over there though. There definitely are. There's a little horse trail right behind my camp. I don't know if you can see a horse and rider going through or not. It's turned out to be a pretty lovely evening. These guys are literally walking in circles. <laughs> They've been walking around all morning while I've been cleaning up my van. Yeah, y'all are friendly, all right? Just want to know why you're here. I just woke up a little bit ago. It's already pretty light out there. Guess I was tired. These guys just wandered by. Mo move along yeah that's what we're doing hanging out with cows So I didn't really just come out here to play with the cows this weekend. I came out to do kind of an inventory of the van, um, see where I'm at clothes-wise and stuff. Since I'm a part-time van dweller, I, I have all kinds of stuff in here, but I'm getting ready for a little road trip, so I need to take out the things I really don't need and throw in a couple things that I do need. So yeah, that's kind of the name of the game with van dwelling. <laughs> you have to have everything in its place and a place for everything or things get out of control real quick. So. Just trying to, like I said, organize really well so when I do go on my road trip, it'll be less stressful. Um, it's a true story. If you have too much stuff and too small of a space, it's stressful. It, everything just becomes more difficult. So, yeah, I really need to weed out a few things. Part of the problem is yeah, I bring my e-bike with me, and I don't want to hang it outside. I don't want the weather and everything to affect it, so... It's one of the things that I just kind of have to put up with because I really, really want to take my e-bike everywhere I go. I use it a lot. So, yep, got to make some concessions so that all this works. Anyway, I am super excited. I am finally going to get to take a little break, go do some serious camping, little road trip. 
So stay tuned in the next week or so. I should be on the road. Undisclosed location. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you soon. Y'all stay lost, my friends.